commute for light rail riders a bit easier this morning, at least for a little while. Yeah, light rail trains are back to their regular schedule after being delayed due to repairs, causing a pretty big headache for commuters. Fox 13's John Hopperstead has been there all morning with what the rest of the summer will look like. Starting this morning, the trains are running every 10 minutes, which is back to normal and actually ahead of schedule over here uh, on the northbound side. That hasn't been the case for the last week or so. It was completely shut down. In fact, we saw people who thought that was still the case this morning having to run from the southbound side over to the, to the northbound side because their train was showing up in that area and they just about missed it on their way to work here. We were, at, we were here last week as well when workers closed it off and began work to replace tiles on the platform due to safety concerns and that limited trains to coming through here every 20 minutes. That also delayed trains south of here caused a headache for a lot of people who rely on a regular schedule to get to and from work. Oh uh, yeah, I totally didn't expect it, so I might be late for work today. <laughs> So with the trains back on schedule earlier than anticipated, it's going to be good news this weekend for folks heading to the Mariners game, Sounders match, even the Capitol Hill block party. But what we saw happening here over the last week is really a precursor of things to come in just under a month. Similar work is going to be done on the southbound platform here starting on August 19th. And we are going to see a series of delays in service uh, really into 2023 as crews do repair work and also expand light rail by about 33 miles. In Seattle, John Opperstead, Fox 13 News.